What is going on guys? It is your fellow Tono Defton here and I am back with another video on Warframe. I'm sorry I have been kind of, uh, you know, not really uploading as much, but you have to understand that it is because of school and I've said this on my streams. So without any more delay, let's just go ahead and get right into this episode of Beginner's Luck. Now if this is your first time watching this series, this is basically a guide to Warframe. I literally take a look at the game. I take a look at as many different aspects as I can and I try and explain all those different aspects and this can be geared towards newer players or older players uh, such as veteran players who are coming back to the game who haven't played for a while or you know you've missed out you know a couple of months or whatever and you want to really get caught up I will be doing beginners luck episodes for uh, those uh, those Tenno who are you know gone for a couple months they're taking a break or whatever and then you know they come back and they see all this new stuff, they're like, what the heck is this? I'll be doing episodes for those too, so if you are looking forward to that, or if that is something you are interested in, please go ahead and click that subscribe button so that you can get updated on these new episodes whenever they come out. Anyway, today's topic is going to be... Mastery. Today's topic is actually going to be mastery and I the reason why I actually came to this decision is I thought about it and there is not really any uh, explicit uh, real tutorial uh, in the, like that tutorial mission phase uh, in the very beginning of you know you actually becoming a Tenno and you know you actually getting your Warframe and everything like that it doesn't really explicitly state it doesn't really explicitly state how you actually gain mastery ranks and I think that that's an important thing for some people because some people might find that as a uh, as a drive to actually keep on going and uh, some people might just rack up mastery without even really knowing how they are doing it and then they get to a point where they're like oh okay well I'm, I'm not really understanding how I'm getting this mastery or okay well I don't really I don't really understand this but it's not really happening anymore I'm not really gaining mastery why is that so I'm going to go ahead and explain to you exactly what mastery is and how to get it or how to achieve higher mastery ranks so first of all what is mastery mastery is basically just a collection of weapons and warframes that you've gathered affinity for uh, and maxed out for the first time and you might be wondering what the heck affinity is affinity is basically the XP of Warframe so if you go ahead and look over here if I go into my codex I go into universe I go into weapons you could go ahead and see all of the the weapons that I've actually mastered I haven't mastered all of them obviously because I'm only mastery rank 20 but I have mastered a majority of them and I plan on mastering every single one of them if I can I only have a few left actually so I, that's really not <laughs> this is not far-fetched at all but um yeah so uh, all these all these things right here are options that you can that you can actually master and that gives you mastery points or that gives you mastery XP toward your mastery rank and that's how you actually rank up and warframes are also susceptible to actually giving you this mastery XP as well so go ahead and get those new warframes and actually level them up uh, as well as those new weapons level them up uh, and also one thing that is very, very important, some people might think, oh, well, you know, there's this wonderful thing called Forma that I could just, you know, basically, uh, prestige, I guess, would be the, the best thing to compare it to. Uh, I could just prestige my Warframe, and I could go ahead and make my Warframe, uh, or Warframe and or weapon, uh, back to rank zero, and then I could level it up again, and then I could get more mastery points. That is not the case. Not the case at all, I repeat. <laughs> using forma on a weapon or warframe and then leveling it up again will not give you more mastery points it just won't in order to get mastery you have to actually max out the weapon or warframe the first time and that's what gives you mastery points so that's one thing to consider uh, if you're looking to actually gain mastery you have to try and get as many different and unique weapons and warframes as possible unique meaning you're not you know overlapping and getting uh, you know you're using the same weapon over and over again or the same warframe over and over again and just leveling them up constantly of course it's okay to do that but that's not gonna give you mastery so if you have not actually gotten to mastery rank one yet uh, you might not know this but once you hit a mastery rank what happens is you actually get tested 
and recently there was an update that actually made it so that you get an alert on the bottom right of your screen whenever you enter your ship as well as something on the top here that actually tells you that you have a mastery uh, or, or rank up test available now you go ahead and go into that mastery rank test and then you go ahead and do it hey, you, you do the mastery rank test you see if you can actually complete it what I suggest is you actually go into the relays and I will uh, show you exactly how to get to a relay. Uh, the closest one in the very beginning of the game is on Mercury. That's the most common one and that's the one that you most likely will want to go to. Now, uh, there's a specific spot that you want to go to in these relays in order to actually uh, help you with your mastery rank tests and I will show you by teleporting there. Now. Okay, we made it to this room. Uh, so, we are in the Cephalon Samaris room. I actually do have a contract to get from him, so let me just go ahead and uh, talk to him really, really quick. Okay, so I just finished talking to him. I got my uh, daily uh, quest or whatever from him. But where you want to go is actually, once you're in this room, and you could actually teleport here by going up here to fast travel and then selecting Cephalon Samaris or if you want to actually run there you go to the back of the relay you take the elevator up and it's the door to the right now uh, where you actually want to go once you are in here is you want to go ahead and look at the right and you have all of these different panels here and this is where you could actually take your mastery test for the the upcoming mastery rank so as you can tell I am mastery rank 20 so if I go all the way up to 21 I believe no no this is it's here I think it's either here or here yeah yes yes this one right here I could actually take this master rank test and uh, see exactly what it is about and you can actually do it before you have to actually do it live so that you don't fail now if you do fail the master rank test don't worry, you don't have to level up again or whatever. That's what I thought originally, and I got really scared because it was around the time where this wasn't available. Um, so I was always afraid to take my master rank test, but then I realized, um, you know, I, I actually did fail at one time. I was like, no, no, and everything. And then it actually told me 24 hours. So if you actually fail, don't worry, it's not going to make you redo the entire thing. All it is going to make you do is retake it in 24 hours. You can't take it any sooner. Um, you can take it later, obviously. But 24 hours is the minimum time that you have to wait before you can take it again if you do fail. So, that is basically all you have to know about Mastery Ranks. Uh, how to actually get Mastery Ranks. How to actually level up. Uh, what, those, uh, what those Mastery Rank tests are. Uh, look like how you can actually see ahead for your upcoming mastery rank and actually test for that mastery rank or practice for it I should say um, so all of these things can come and help you out when you're actually trying to level up your mastery and uh, get up there with the with the 23s 23 is the max right now by the way uh, with those 23s uh, up there in the in, in the, the, the the warframe the warframe list of people with high mastery ranks Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something from this episode. If you did, please go ahead and leave a like, leave a comment, letting me know what you thought of this episode. Do you like these? I don't know. Let me know. Let me know down in the comments, and I will, of course, respond. I love responding to you guys. As I said, I am busy with school, so I probably won't be uploading as often. But um, when I actually do catch a break, when I do feel comfortable, I will be posting very, very often, very frequently. And I will be doing a lot of uh, streams as I used to do, um, you know, back in uh, the beginning of January. So we'll get back to that schedule one day soon. Uh, thank you, Tenno, for sticking with me. If you are returning, I love you all. And I'll catch you guys in the next video and or stream. Peace.